What's up, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpios? What's up with my water signs? Welcome back to the Fly Empress Tarot. If this is your first time joining us, please like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the notification bell. This is your new moon reading in Taurus coming up May the 11th, 2021, you guys. This reading will not resonate with everyone. Take what resonates with you and leave the rest behind, okay? Leave the rest behind. Leave it right there. Look right there. Wait into this reading and see what's going on. What's the energy around the water signs for the new moon in Taurus, okay? Divine Holy Spirit, ancestors, and spirit guides of the pure white light. Show me what I need to see for the water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpios. What is the energy coming up around the Cancer, Pisces, and the Scorpios? For the new moon in Taurus, May 2021, Spirit, show me what I need to see. Show me what I need to see, Spirit. What's going on? Okay, so we got solitude and positive movement forward. So you guys are taking time out for yourself, resting, rejuvenating. Um, I feel like really... <laughs> Sacrifice and destruction. What? Spirit, show me why I need. Mm. We got the throat shot. Yeah, because they were getting them an early. All right, so we have solitude. With the solitude card, I feel like you guys are spending time by yourself. Or you're really going within and reflecting on if you're on the right path or you're studying something new for some of you guys. Some of you guys are working on healing yourself. You could be taking up different courses or classes. I, I hear yoga. Some people are taking up yoga. Some people are learning about the chakras as well. I feel like a lot of you guys are going to be spending your time investing in yourself, reflecting, all right? Positive movement forward. You're moving forward in your life. You're, you're on the right track. That boat is going to the sun now. See it? See it? It's going to the sun. So, yeah. And then we got sacrifice here. So, for some of you guys, you had to sacrifice things in your life so that you could get on the right path, okay? It was a lot of things that you had to let go. You had to release yourself of a lot of toxins, a lot of negativity, a lot of dark energy. And this could have been in your environment, but this could have been stored inside of you. Okay, a lot of you guys, I feel like your true colors is going to be shining. Okay, yeah, I just see a lot of people being authentic to themselves as well. I see, I see a lot of people being authentic or dressing like themselves or just doing them. Not really focusing or worrying on anybody else. Okay, so we got, we also got the destruction card here. So with the destruction card, I feel like, for one, I feel like somebody is thinking of you. Someone is really torn to pieces about you. Someone could be up late at night because they know that you're on the break of a big change. For many of you guys, you're going to be using your voice. Are you going to be speaking some type of truth? Some of you guys could have, um, some of you guys could speak publicly as well. And it's something that's coming into fruition. This is the waiting game here with the, with the hourglass. This is the waiting game. And I feel like this person, whoever this is, I feel like they envy you. They, this person either, either envy you or they know something big is coming towards you. And I feel like it's really bothering this person because they feel like you're going to get away. 
for some of you, this is a relationship. But for some of you guys, this is a friend. This could be somebody that you're dealing with. Somebody that know that you're made, making some major changes in your life. I feel like whoever this is, they torn the fuck up about it. Okay? Yeah, and with the waiting game here, I feel like something is only a matter of time. It's, it's You guys could be receiving some news about something. But whatever it is, it's a matter of time. But I feel like somebody's watching you. Okay? You got a stalker. You got somebody watching you. Somebody peeking in your window. Pow! <laughs> For real. I'm serious. Somebody could be watching you on your social media. Or if you got a YouTube channel, somebody watching you. But somebody is watching you. Somebody... Is observing you. They know. This person know you. This person know you in a deep way. I feel. Like this person I got close to you. This ain't just some associate. That somebody you've been just dealing with. This somebody you done had a connection with. Like I said. This could be a friend. Or some fuck ass relationship. Like Bernie Mac would say. This, this would be somebody you was in a relationship with. Yeah. Mm. That was like this. Also, you guys, this could be because these cars are beside each other. All right. Oh, this, one, this way, I guess. I think, yeah. Anyway, this one is first, okay? So, this one is sacrifice. This one is disruption. So, I feel like, you guys, if you was dealing with somebody from the past, this person has left a karmic or a third party that they was dealing with. This person has left this third party here. And they want to come and talk to you with the throat chakra on the other side of the car. They want to come and talk to you, but they they feel like it's a waiting game or they feel like you're giving them the silent treatment or something, okay? Or this person is ready, is going to catch you around or they're going to catch you off guard. It's a waiting game. Somebody want to come in and speak the truth with you. I feel like whoever this is, this person going through a lot right now. Yeah. They torn, like torn to pieces. This person has been guarding their heart for a long time. Mm. Yeah, this person has been guarding their heart for a long time here. Mm. Let's see. Let me pull a couple of more real quick. Let me see. Divine Holy Spirit, ancestors and spirit guides of the pure white light. Show me what I need to see for the water signs. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpios for the new moon and Taurus coming up. Show me what I need to see, Divine Holy Spirit, ancestors and spirit guides. Show me what I need to see for the water signs. Cancer. Ooh, okay. Propose. Okay. So we got propose here. I know what I'm here to do. Okay, so yes, you guys are spending solid too because you know what you are here to do. You have found your purpose. You have found your purpose in life and you know exactly what you need to do here. Yes. And then we got relationships. I am attracted to those people who serve my higher good. And then this is positive movement forward. Like, you got, if you guys ever did with some bullshit, if you dealt with some bullshit in the past, you know, you know what's your highest good. You know what's good for you. You're not going to settle for, you're not going to settle for no punk ass relationship. You're not going to go through that. You're not going to go through the things that you went through in the past here. You're just not. You're moving forward in your life. You moving forward. You you moving away from conflict. You have found your purpose. You don't found your path. Your purpose and your path. Oh my goodness! Wow, y'all. 
<laughs> you just don't know how this is resonating with me right now. Real talk. Like on my Facebook page, my cover, my cover behind my profile picture is um there's nothing more, there's not nothing more amazing or nothing more important than finding your purpose in your path. Yes, I got that on my, my page. Spirit, show me what I need to see. Show me what I need to see, Spirit. Show me what I need to see. Show me what I need to see, Divine Holy Spirit. Why sacrifice here? Carriage. Yeah. So you guys, you have the carriage to take the life that was destined for you. You guys done really went within and you done did the work. And now you're able to talk to spirit and spirit has pointed you on your purpose and your path. And you guys are so excited about this. Definitely a lot of crown in third eye chakra activity a lot a lot a lot of crown in third eye activity here show me what <clears throat> okay so on the throw chakra friendships in the reverse here yeah so I, <laughs> This could be, like I said, this could be a friend, you guys. It could be a friend here. I feel like it's a friend here. They want to talk to you, but they can't talk to you. Or this is a, a past relationship where somebody want to come back in and communicate, but they feel like they can't. And this is also you guys, whatever new beginning you got going on with you is some friends that's going to be cut out your life. And it just is what it is. You know what I'm saying? A lot of you guys are accelerating on another level. So some people going to fall off and that's not your fault. And you don't need that. Don't even worry why. Okay. Let them people fall off and you connect with your soul tribe. Real talk. You don't like, you just don't have time for the BS no more. Spirit, show me what I need to see. Why is destruction here? Why is destruction here? <laughs> Freedom. All right. For destruction. Okay. So, like I said, you guys, I feel like this person, whoever this is, they done been freed up from some other relationship. This person is still very guarded at this time. And it says, I possess the power and the free will to create my own happiness. So this person is really actually ready to start doing the work and putting the work into themselves. Okay. This person is freeing themselves from a toxic relationship, which I feel like this person, both of the people was toxic. And this is also you guys, you, you freeing yourself from any destruction in your life. If anything don't serve your highest good, you're going to be letting it go, okay? You want freedom from this. You don't want to be stressed out, worried in your head all the time. And a lot of you guys are starting to see that you can create your own happiness. You got what it takes. You can get out here and do whatever you want. You can have whatever you like. <laughs> yeah, real talk. I love it. Yes. Spirit, why is waiting game here? Why is waiting game here, Spirit? Why is waiting game here? Okay, we got peace in the reverse here for waiting game. So it says, I am, I am a being of love and I release negative energy. And this came out in the reverse. So somebody is going through a lot of destruction in their life and they feel like you're giving them the silent treatment or this is some type of waiting game. This person has no peace in their life right now. Okay. This person, like I said, they very, very guarded at this time. This person done been hurt. Yes, this person done been hurt, you guys. And I feel like it was karma. I feel like this person has received a lot of bad karma because of the way they've been living their life. Yeah. 
bottom of the deck, Dell, Dell, something here is coming to an end. Something's here is something here is coming to a end. Yes. I'ma just pull a couple of tarot cards, you guys. And uh I'ma pull a trinket and that's gonna be it. But something coming to an end, and I see you guys taking off, okay? Yeah. Somebody wanna come back in, you guys. Divine Holy Spirit, ancestors and spirit guides of the pure white light. Show me what I need to see for the water signs for the new moon in Taurus. Divine Holy Spirit, Archangel Michael, protect me as I channel these messages. Archangel Gabriel, give me clear communication. Show me what I need to see for the water signs. Show me what I need to see for the water signs. What's the situation for the water sign for the new moon in Taurus? Temperance, balance, balance is coming in now. Like, I feel like you guys are finna get your justice, okay? You're gonna be in a place of peace and harmony. You guys are gonna be solitude. You're gonna be still working on yourself. Like, you're really tempering your emotions. Like, I feel like a whole 360. You guys are very, very balanced during this new moon in Taurus here. You guys, I do feel like grounded energy. Like, why it feels good you know what i'm saying i can't even explain it okay this is what's crossing this this is somebody who wants to come back in but not sure how i feel like this person is they're looking at you or this person is watching you okay but somebody want to communicate but they're not doing it at this time yeah yeah Spirit, what's in the subconscious? What's in the subconscious spirit? What's up in what's in the subconscious? Okay, so strength. You guys, you have the strength to do whatever you're trying to do, and you're gonna be very successful at it. Okay. Like I just heard the stars are aligned for you. Okay, this is the energy. This is the energy you guys need to be working in. Yes, real talk. Spirit, why is strength here? We got two major arcanas down here. Okay, yeah, you guys are walking away from anything that does not serve your highest good. But I feel like, you guys, this person, whoever you've been dealing with from the past, this person... This person don't want to walk away from this connection here. They're trying to go within and find the strength to come back in. It's somebody that's trying to come back in, you guys. But I feel like they just watching you at this time. But for a lot of you guys, you're walking away from things that does not serve your highest good. Yeah, some of you guys could have been dealing with a Sagittarius or a Leo. Divine Holy Spirit, what's going on in the conscience? What's going on? Emperor, okay? Yes, you guys are building your legacy. You're working on yourself. You're working on your prosperity. A lot of you guys is fixing to receive. A lot of you guys, eh, if I can talk, bad, bad, bad. A lot of you guys is fixing to receive spiritual prosperity, all right? You guys are running your queendom or your kingdom the right way. Like, y'all, you got all major arcanas in a row here. In a row. You are you're ruling your kingdom or your queendom with an iron fist. You're being focused. You're being very pristine, Pris, pristine. No, I'm country spirit. I don't know what that is, pristine. Okay. You guys are really holding, holding down your fortress. I just feel like you guys are thriving as well. It's almost like you floating. Divine Holy Spirit, why is the Emperor here? Why is the Emperor here, Spirit? Why is the Emperor here? Why? 
Oh. Let me see. Mm. Yeah. So justice popped out for the emperor. So I, like I said, I feel like this is somebody from the past trying to come back in. It's somebody from the past with the emperor in justice right here. I feel like <laughs> y'all, I'm picking up on narcissist energy right now, to be honest with you. I am with the emperor in justice here. This is somebody who's very controlling, somebody who wants control, somebody who seeks control. Someone, someone with a closed heart. This person think very narrow-mindedly. Yes. This person think very narrow-mindedly. But I feel like this person, they want to come back in, but at the same time, they want to feel like they in control of this situation because this person wants you to chase them. This person wants you to chase them. This person know that they don't have anything to offer you here. This person is not solid. They're not stable at this time. And they're not making any plans to come towards you because they want you to come towards them because they are narcissists. They narcissist ass. Ooh. And with the king of pentacles here in the reverse, yeah, this person is very greedy. This person, they use people for what they got because they they don't put in the work. They feel like things should be handed to them. Okay? And this person is just not a great father either. No, there. I feel like this person could be in and out of their kid's life. Some kids, they don't even acknowledge. Yeah. This person is a fucking prick. Yeah, but they don't have anything to offer you. But it's like this person want to try to have some type of control over you. Yeah. Divine Holy, Divine Holy Spirit, what happened in your past here for the water signs? Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. What happened? Okay. So. Okay, so the four of wands was in the reverse here. And then the page of wands flipped in reverse as well for the past. I feel like in the past, someone was in their head regarding the situation, regarding the household. And this person was very stuck and stagnant at first. I feel like they wasn't making any moves. But now I feel like this person has up and left or this person is repressing their feelings. They, somebody start repressing their feelings here in the near past. If this was a third party situation, this person they really thought about it. They had been thinking about it for a while to leave this. And there was some recent tower that happened. This person left. I feel like at this time, they kind of, they, they still close off to their emotions. This person is still closed off to their emotions. Siri, give me one more card for the near past. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, this person with the Ace of Wands being reversed here in the Four of Swords here in the reverse. This person is thinking about, they started thinking about all the bad decisions that they made in the past. I feel like this person put head number two over head number one. And it was a lot of things that they shouldn't have been doing. And because of the error of their ways, because of their behaviors, they ended up getting put out their house. Okay. 
this person was really in the streets, very passionate, just out here. Some of them was out here just making babies. Mm. Okay, so then we got the Page of Cups and then the Ace of Cups came up here. So I feel like... I feel like this person started pushing back the way they felt about this third party situation here. They saw that nothing was going to grow here. This person started looking towards you. Okay, this person started to look bad because I feel like this person could have left you for another person here. This person started to look back and they're, they starting to see that they had a good thing. That's exactly what this is. They're starting to see that they did have a good thing. And now they want to come back. This person is ready to... This person is ready to drop this way of living. Such as having sex out here drinking. Just doing God knows what. And this person is really looking at the error of their ways. This person want a new beginning with you. Here. Whew. This reading was supposed to be about us. You know, but but like I said, Dale, for a lot of you guys, I feel like you in in this. You don't want nothing to do with this. A lot of you guys, you will be releasing this person during this energy here. Divine Holy Spirit, what, what's going on for the near future? <laughs> okay. So... Wow. Hmm. So for the near future, we got judgment came in. Okay. I feel like for a lot of you guys, you know that this person ain't truly healed. You know this person haven't fully released themselves of all these negative energy. It's a lot of things that this person is still keeping and you guys know this. You know that this person won't be completely honest with you. And for a lot of you guys, you know that this person will never apologize. Some of you guys have never received the apology from this person. But I feel like they don't try to come back in. But when they come in, it's like, hey, how you doing? Or happy Mother's Day or happy birthday or something like that. This person ain't never apologized to you for the shit that they did. But there's a tower that's coming up here. There's a tower coming up here. I'm going to clarify that tower. And we also got the Queen of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles. So either way, you guys are going to be good. I feel like you guys are going to be on your own. You're going to be independent, okay? You're going to be stable, a good mom. You're taking care of your house. You're taking care of your queendom, okay? Yes. You're taking care of that. Divine Holy Spirit, clarify this tower. Why is the tower here, spirit? <clears throat> oh, no, spirit. Too many. <laughs> oh. Why is the tower here? Okay, yeah, you guys are going to be moving forward. I feel like you and this person might end up having a conversation. And you're going to be like, look, I don't want nothing to do with you. I just want to move on with my life here. Spirit, give me another card. A lot of majors is hopping out of here, you guys. Yeah, we got the Empress in the reverse here. The Empress is in the reverse. This person, I feel like they're going to try to come towards you and you guys are going to turn them down, okay? This person, you know that they haven't fully healed. You know that this person still ain't right and you're not finna deal with this in your life. You know, the Three of Swords, this is going to cause heartbreak to this person, okay? Because a lot of you guys are going to walk away. And the problem is most men or women that's done did wrong, they feel like the other person is going to wait on them because they was in love with them. No, that's not how it works. That's not how it works, okay? Nobody is going to sit and wait on you to get your shit together, all right? Either your shit together or it's, it's together or it ain't. And if it ain't, I got to keep going because I'm not going to put my life on hold. So, yes, you guys are going to, uh, I feel like it's going to be some type of conversation that's going to happen here. Spirit, why is the judgment in the reverse? 
Why is judgment in the reverse here? Why is judgment in the reverse? Why is judgment in the reverse? Ooh. Yeah, I feel like this person, they don't want you to pass judgment on the, on them, okay? This person wants to come back from out of the cold here. This person ready to come back from out of the cold. And I feel like when you guys turn this person down, it's going to fucking kill them, okay? Because for so long, they tried to take control of the situation because they was manipulative and lying. This person was a cheater. And this person, I feel like they was very dominant. This person tried to rule over you. They tried to rule over you. But meanwhile, they not even stable. They ain't got shit to offer you. You know, they greedy, self-centered. The Eight of Pentacles, you guys, in your emotions, you're working on yourself. You're working on yourself here. Spirit, clarify the Eight of Pentacles. <laughs> that was cute. I like that. Y'all didn't see it, but the car turned and it flipped. That was cute. Show me what I need to see. Okay, Nine of Pentacles. I feel like this person is going to start working on themselves and they're going to try to bring forward you guys a stable offer here. They're going to try to bring you guys a stable offer. I feel like it's slow though. It's going to be so slow. But I don't feel like you guys are going to be waiting on this. And this is also you guys working on yourself, okay? You guys are going to be working on yourself. I feel like you guys are being very strategic. You're really focusing on yourself and what you're trying to obtain, what you're trying to grow, okay? You guys are really putting in the work on yourself. What's going on in the environment, Spirit? What's going on in the environment? Yeah, okay. So you guys... I feel like for some of you guys, you don't got a reading done. Are you guys, you have a sense that you are very guarded, especially after this past relationship that you was in. A lot of you guys, I feel like you're going to be letting your guards down because you're ready for new love. You're ready for true love. You're ready to give it another shot. Okay. I feel like some of you guys, you decide to be on your own for a little while, but now you're ready to re let your guard down and you're ready to get back out in the dating world okay yeah some of you guys are ready to get back in the dating world but this is also this person probably wanting you to let your guard down but see okay so yeah somebody wants you to let your guard down okay because this person says that they're not gonna they not they're not going to cheat on you. They're not going to portray you like they did in the past. So now they want you to let your guard down here. All right. But with the two of ones, this person still not coming towards you. It's in the reverse. All right. I feel like this person don't went back and forth in their head. Whether they should reach out to you. Whether they should talk to you. This person now probably wrote you a hundred messages and don't erase them. Because they so self-centered and in their head. And they try Yeah. This person, <laughs> they want to take a leap of faith towards you, but their ego still won't let them because they are still not finished healing here. All right? This is the fool in the reverse. Yeah. Yeah, they, they, they fear. I feel like they fear you rejecting them. Yep. Bottom of the deck. Damn. They fear that you're you're going to tell them that you don't want nothing else to do with them. You guys, that's exactly what that is. You got Major Arcana clarifying Major Arcana here. This is something big. Divine Holy Spirit, what's the outcome? What's the outcome, Spirit? What's the outcome? I still feel like it's some type of communication that's going to take place. What's Mm. Spirit, what's the outcome? What's the outcome, Spirit? <laughs> Do y'all really want to know these cards? Oh my God. Okay, you guys. So this could be two scenarios here. We got the lovers, the six of wands, and the Knight of Cups, okay? 
So for some of you guys, you're going to be receiving a new romantic relationship, okay? And I feel like it's going to be a lot of victory and success, okay? This is going to be new. You're going to have those butterflies again. You're going to look forward to seeing this person. I feel like this person is really going to be into you too. You know, y'all know how it is when you first meet somebody. You, you know, you want to be around them all the time. The sex is, <laughs> the sex is great. <laughs> but also, you guys, <laughs> if you turn this person away and you tell them, look, you know what, I forgive you, but I know you still not right, and I, at this time, I don't trust you. You need to get yourself together. You know, I'm, I'm not going to wait on you forever. It took you this long to come back and even apologize to me. You know what I'm saying? I really feel like your person, whoever you was dealing with, they going to go and put in the work, okay? This person is going to come back, and you guys are going to end up being together because y'all are soulmates, okay? It's going to be a lot of victory and success. But I feel like you guys are going to start over or take it very slow, okay? Y'all going to be taking it very slow here. But for some of you guys, I see a new boo. I see a new boo, and it's going to be good, baby. All right? And for some of you, this past person is going to come back, okay? And I feel like you guys are going to end it with them, but it's going to cause this person to actually put the work into themselves. Okay, this person still have healing that they need to do. They still, they still have stuff that they need to work out here. Real talk, this person gotta work out their issues. All right, you guys, so I'm gonna pull a trinket and see what's going on. Okay, divine holy spirit ancestors and spirit guides of the pure white light, show me what I need to see for the water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. But it's new moon and Taurus, divine holy spirit. Show me what I need to see. What do the Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio? <laughs> oh my goodness, y'all. So it's a heart with a nurse's hat on it. So whoever you've been dealing with, this person feel like only you can heal their heart. This person know. I just heard, cause you got that whip appeal, so put it on me. Yeah, hold on, what, 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 what is that? Baby face, baby face, whip appeal. Y'all need to listen to that. Yes, uh, somebody needs some sexual healing, okay? Somebody needs some working done on. <laughs> This person feel like you the only one that can heal their heart. They miss you. Some of you guys could work in the healthcare field. Some of you guys could be nurses, okay? Doctors, CNAs. Yes, but whoever this is, they feel as if you're the only one that can heal them. Divine Holy Spirit, show me another thing here. What else I need to see for the Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces? We got the cross. We got the cross with Jesus on it. I'm trying to see if there's some writing. It looks like it, but I can't I can't read it. So with this here, I feel like this person is this person gonna be connecting with God. God gonna be talking to this person here. Do you hear me? I like I said, I feel like a death and resurrection a, a but. I feel like a death and resurrection here, especially with Jesus. He actually is on the cross. So, yeah, this person is going to have to go through this, all right? This person is going to have to kill the old way and rebirth a new way within them. <laughs> but this person know that you, that you, you got that whip of you. <laughs> But this person know that you have the key to healing their heart. Yeah. 
Well, that's why I got you guys. If you like this content, please like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to ring the notification bell. Until we see each other again, I love you guys so, 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 so much. Bye.